So this is going to be a really short video uh, of making a series of 8 inch angle iron shelves that I have for a couple of projects. I have uh, cut a bunch of parts. I'm going to show you a first cut, miter, miter, flip it, uh, and just go through it really fast. 1 inch uh, angle iron, 8th inch. I have a yellow rule set up so that I can kind of cheat and not take all the time to measure it. Um, and to do miters, I just add about half an inch to my length. These don't have to be super precise, so I'm just, that they're all going to be really pretty fast, pretty basic, 45-45. Um, I'll make two to make an L, and then the third leg I'll show you where I cut a little custom. Okay, so I've got my brackets for D Brook Salon and the other uh, single shelf that I'm doing. And so what I'm doing is chamfering the inside where I'm going to do the weld, and these will all be painted. So, so. Real quick, just a quick, quick little show. Aggressive grinder. To the outside, I do a flap wheel, a little less aggressive. So what I've done is I've set up a, a quick change out 90 degree so I can do this one corner and then I'll have the measurement for my third leg of the shelf bracket. Um, so what I'm going to do is weld this corner on all of them. A little bit extra. So what, you, what I'm going to end up doing is cutting this out and cutting that out and I'll have a flush miter, same on that side, ear and eye protection. and buzz that in. Same on the opposite side. So with the two pieces cut you end up with a fairly close outside corner. I might grind that so I get a little bit better penetration. Um, and then on the inside you can weld here. I've chamfered that uh, end just a little bit so I can get a nice bead. This angle already has a little roll to it. Same on that side. You will end up with a clean back side. Okay, so I've got my got my parts, got my holes, got my uh, screw tapers. So take my part, which um, slide that in there. The I put the plate on the long end so they can actually move it around, adjust to where it comes out to this edge, uh, square it up and I don't need to put those against the wall because they're just not going to move that much. Now I have a weld here, a weld here, and I left this exposed uh, so I can get to it to weld one of the two ends while I'm at it.
Okay, there we go. Nine of them. One long shelf and three shorts. Um, tomorrow I'll go over them one last time, clean them up, get them uh, degreased, ready for paint.